Hello everybody, welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. My name is Mr. Nickname. Um, As a daily so now, I wonder where we it might lead me. Uh, we're about to meet that goblin which we gave the helmet so he can gain Ranrock's trust, but it didn't work actually. So he has another plan right now. Let's see what he has to offer. Hello there. Actually, no, that's not. Hello, all meet. I think that's another. Of course. Spell. How that's exciting! Another, that's another quest. I mean, well, might this be dangerous? I think he simply wants to show me something that involves gobbledygook. If it helps, he's a friend of Serona's. Good to hear. No, no, Good that's that quest's about him. If I'm Serona sorry. trusts him, then I feel much better. Uh, Lord Gok is waiting. Should we go? Of course. I just want to check the pronunciation of a couple of key terms first. So I will meet you there. Hey, do I have to go by myself? Oh, that's actually far. That's too far. So we should I go. Okay. I've got the exact checkpoint for... for me to go there. Off on another adventure, are we? Another adventure, are we? Yes, we are. So he's supposed to be somewhere here. There he is. A friend who speaks gobbledygook is meeting us. Before he arrives, perhaps you could tell me why we're here? Of course. Unfortunately, presenting Ranrock with the helmet of Earthgot did not have the effect I'd hoped. Because he knew the details surrounding its plunder, he presumed I'd had help from a witch or wizard in retrieving it. How else did he expect Goblin Kind to get the helmet back? Seems he has no interest in making amends with you. I'm afraid we do not have the luxury of rational expectation when it comes to Ranrock. Damn Bragbor and his blasted journals. Bragbor? An ancestor of Ranrock's, renowned metal worker. If we are to work together, I suppose I must tell you more. Not long ago, Ranrock sent me to collect a recently unearthed set of Bragbor's journals. They described repositories that Bragbor had been commissioned to build for a group of witches and wizards. What do you mean, repositories? Large, magically fortified receptacles crafted from goblin metal. Ranrock recruited others to help me locate the repositories. We were to search anywhere that was connected to five names mentioned in the journals. Rackham, Fitzgerald, Bacar, Morganock, and Rookwood. Rookwood Castle. That is where we began our search. Why does Ranrock care so much about these repositories? He cares about what they contain. For centuries, wizards have refused to share their magical knowledge with goblins. <laughs> Your kind will not even let us carry wands. Thus, many goblins, myself included, have spent our lives mistrusting wizard kind. Ranrock was convinced that the repositories contained a magical power that wizards wanted to keep for themselves. He was, is, determined to take it for goblin kind. But he's... Here comes my friend Armit. Probably best to continue our conversation later. Greetings, Lord Gok. It is an honor, sir. You speak gobbledygook. Oh, Bagalio. Enough. Please do not tell me that was meant to be gobbledygook. I, um, well, yes. Perhaps my pronunciation was a bit off. I imagine certain dialects differ. Pronunciation is not the issue. I barely recognize that as language. I trust you can read gobbledygook better than you can speak it? I can, Sir Lodcock. Just Lodcock. Thankfully, we only need someone who can decipher written plans, since I cannot join you in the mine. What written plans? And why can't you come with us? We need some idea of what Ranrock knows or is plotting. I suspect a careless loyalist may have left plans behind. And I'm unable to join you because I cannot risk anyone reporting my presence to Ranrock. All you need to do is not be seen either by the eye above the enchanted door, or a loitering loyalist. I'll meet and I can do this. I will await your return. 
All right. I shall see you soon. So that's another quest where we have to... Is that a melee trial? Yeah, it is, but I have no melee trials. Yeah. So this I, in order to get in there, you have to become invisible. All the door right. is looking at us. Okay, it's open. Books so rarely prepare one for reality. A real goblin mine. It's even grander than I had expected. I cannot believe I met a goblin. Let's just learn what we can and get out. Look at this lift. Impressive workmanship for so simple a device. Impressive workmanship aside, it's the only way forward. I've read about mines like this, but seeing one is Akio. something else altogether. Hop in. No, you're not coming. We need to be careful. As I'm sure you know, not all goblins are as friendly as log goblins, to say the least. Are you stuck, bro? Oh, shit. Where have those plans gone? I had schematics in my hand a moment ago. Someone left. One less shoe that's a worry about. What the shit? Let me open. I will not be made a fool. Incendio. No! Oh, I, so. I will make you pay. Defender. That was a little more than I'm used to. I'll get us through his safety line. Right? That's what I want. Descender! Propeller! Good pulse, sir! What should I do with that? Akio! He won't get through as long as we can be seen by that eye. See if we can find any plans. Bound to be plans around here somewhere. Quiet. A schematic. They're building something. I can't quite make it out. Curious. Let me know if you see any more plans or schematics. We can't return to Lodgok empty-headed. Revelio. I 
Alright, we've got some money. Money is always good to find. No shit. Right. Don't wish to be seen, do we? Fascinating to see gobbledygook written in a goblin hand. The flourishes are extraordinary. I will get to the bottom of what they've been building down here. I do have to scream out everything you say. If I'm translating it correctly, and I think that I am, they're building something rather large. But what? There must be more nodes around here. What could yeah. they be building? Oh, dude. Oh, they got me. They got me. They got me. They got me. You're making this Boiler. This place is more com another schematic. What are they going to build? This mine is too small for whatever it is. That something here. Another health potion. Is that a dead end? Oh, uh, I suppose. Okay, so go, go this way. So the goal was not to be seen, but anyway. Anyways. With such a good wizard, we can take on a bunch of goblins. Easy. Easy, like, look! Enjoy suffering, do ya? Is that the best you can do? It's such a big smell! What do you think for the officer? Your mother is great with Many other. Just gonna kill them all. Oh, uh, what are we looking for? Oh, okay. Oh, 
Okay. This is not good. They're building enormous drills, bigger than this mine could contain. Let's get out of here and tell Lodcock what we found. There must be a quicker way out of here than retracing our steps. Revelio. In the law. My breath. What? This was more than I bargained for. I'm glad oh, you yeah, you're a wizard. You can do that, of course. Now that we know what they're up to, we can get out of here. You know, when that happens in the other games, when you just uh, lose your uh, companion and he TPs back to you, it's like, what the fuck? And now in this game, we're almost it's, out of here. Uh, it's okay. He's Look, just a wizard. He can do that. A welcome sight indeed. I mean, all wizards can TP, right? Alright, enough with the bullshit. Let's get back to the quest. Let's see what Lodgog has to say. Um, can we please talk? That wasn't so bad, was it? It was. It really was. I'm afraid I've had enough adventure for one day. <laughs> for a lifetime, perhaps. Thank you, Amit. I, I can do it without you. Just shit him back. He's now, if you don't mind, I'd like to have a word with Lodgok. Understood? After this adventure. I'll leave you to it. Your goblin secrets are safe with me. But I get to write the book about this escapade someday. Without further ado, at you. Imagine how many books I have to write with all these adventures. <laughs> They're building enormous drills. We found their plans. Ranrock must be searching for the repositories. I fear you are correct. Other than Rookwood Castle, however, I do not know where else he plans to search. I've been wondering about something else you said before we entered the mine. Yes? If you share Ranrock's views, then why are you helping me? I expected Rookwood Castle to be deserted when I arrived to begin my search. So was surprised to find a witch there who had set up a sort of improvised research site. She was studying something so intently that she almost didn't notice me. When she looked up, I thought she would react with fear or disdain. But instead, she did something that I will never forget. Without a moment's hesitation, she smiled and asked me to sit with her. She told me that she was a researcher and showed me a small, oddly shaped container with a strange symbol on it. She was certain it was made of goblin metal, but was unable to open it. She wanted to work together. Miriam. Yes. But how did you... Professor Fig's wife. He told me of her research, and I know of the container. Ah, the reverence with which she talked of goblins and their intelligence and skill, it caught me entirely off guard. I'd never been treated with such respect by a witch or wizard. So, to my surprise, I let her study the container if she would allow me to search the castle on my own. We parted ways, with her promising to share what she'd learned. More of Renrock's recruits arrived, and we began to dig, eventually locating the first repository. Renrock was thrilled with our discovery, but furious when I told him about Miriam. Berated me for trusting a witch, and I heard she had been killed. You think Renrock murdered her? I don't want to believe it, but... I don't know. After that, something shifted in me. 
I had seen how the power from the repositories was transforming Ranrock, transforming all of them. I could no longer remain a part of it. Thank you, Lord Gok, for telling me this. Hmm. I tell you all of this so that you understand what is at stake. <sighs> Ranrock never found all of Bragbor's journals, but the ones he did find suggest that Bragbor, at some point, built a repository far greater in size than the one beneath Rookwood Castle. What you've discovered here today worries me deeply. If Ranrock learns of the location of that repository, I fear we shall be destined for a great war. I will find out what Ranrock knows. Watch for my owl. So we're gonna go to war one day. Wizards versus uh, goblins. Um, what about this quest? Uh, let's see. Reach level twenty-two. Sebastian is somewhere. I have to go and find them. They're here. Let's check the quests. Oh, meet those guys. I think I suppose I suppose I'm gonna learn the blasting curse, right? Like, not the blasting curse, the the other curse. What was it called? I don't remember, but we'll we'll see. We'll see. You're here. Brilliant. I received your owl. What happened with Ominous? I told him none of us will be able to avoid dark magic forever. So the more we know about Salazar Slytherin and the dark arts, the better prepared we'll be. Unfortunately, only a Gaunt knows the location of the Scriptorium's entrance, and Ominous won't tell me. Hmm. Perhaps I should have a chat with Ominous. You? I suppose it's worth a try. But don't get your hopes up. Ominous is annoyingly stubborn. Nothing new. I know where he is. I'll lead you to him and then leave you to it. Come on. He's this way. All right, let's get to it. I have. I, I think I have the power of a charm. Keep an eye out. Never know who's watching. Mine. Although that hasn't stopped so us before. That he can. He can teach us this spell. Where is it? I think that's it. That's Crucio, or yeah, I think we're gonna teach ourselves Crucio right Strictly now. Strictly speaking, it has. We were caught. Damned poltergeist! Such a nuisance. Lumos. There he is. Good luck. What are you doing here? Hello, Ominous. Do you have a moment? What is it? What have you and Sebastian been up to now? I owe you an apology, Ominous. I wasn't honest with you before about the Undercroft. Sebastian did show it to me. He wanted me to have a safe place to practice some spells to try and catch up to the other fifth years. He didn't think you'd mind. <sighs> I suppose that makes sense. 
It's just Sebastian's been pestering me lately about something and I'm frustrated with him. Don't tell me he's still going on about, what was it, a scriptorium? He told you about that. He did. We were talking about our house founder and he mentioned it. Wouldn't say much more, though. Yes, well, he seems to think it contains the answer to saving Anne. I think it's likely full of dark magic that is better left untouched. Wait, you've never been inside? Of course not. I only know about it because of my favorite aunt, Noctua. She thought like I do. Didn't agree with the family on the use of dark magic. In fact, Noctua. she'd hoped to convince my family that there was more to Salazar Slytherin than worshipping pure blood snakes. She, uh... She'd heard of this scriptorium Case and thought its contents might shed some light on him. She even found the secret entrance in this very corridor. She wrote regularly to my father about her efforts to gain access, and then she simply vanished. No one else ever tried to enter. I'm sorry about your aunt. Don't you want to find out what happened to her? Aunt Noctua went down this path with good intentions and lost her life. I don't want the same to happen again. You don't know that history will repeat itself. Besides, you said your aunt thought like you. This could honor her memory. Get you answers about Slytherin and Sebastian answers for Anne. Your aunt pursued this alone. We could do it together. Hmm. I see what you've done here. And I confess, you've convinced me. I didn't think it possible. Very well. I shall tell you what I know. Fetch Sebastian, I'll wait. I hope I... We don't regret this. Sebastian! Over here! These graves grant access to the scriptorium. Now you'll share? You wouldn't tell me when I practically begged. It wasn't you who told me what I needed to hear. Opening the entrance has something to do with threes. Well, three heads are better than one. It's two heads are better than one. By that logic, three is better than two. Simple mathematics, something's happening. I hope we're ready for this. All right, let's get it. Let's get to it. Repair it. The rubble formed a relief a of a person entry. facing a snake. Signed by Noctua Gaunt. It must be the voice Gaunt. I hear. Lumos. Your family was here. The voice is ancient. Sinister. You hear a voice. It started when you repaired that relief. I hear a whisper saying, speak to me. I'm a parcel mouth. I can hear and speak to snakes. Nearly all known parcel mouths are descended from Salazar Slytherin. I wish all Slytherins could talk to snakes. You might not want the ability to speak parcel tongue. It's often associated with dark wizards. I haven't spoken it in ages, but I'd wager if I speak it now, the door will open. I'm hoping you're having second thoughts. I see no reason we should stop now. It's ironic. When I left home, I vowed to leave the dark arts behind, and yet here I am. Stand back. I hope you can't believe I'm doing uh, this. Die in the process. It worked! <laughs> oh, you possess no, a rare it didn't ability work indeed. You. I had to stop it. Between the two of you, I'm starting to feel left out. Between the two of us? I... Never mind. There's no clear way forward. Where we are now. Like a maze. Salazar Slytherin most likely to be difficult to The door we came from, it closed. And there's more than one gate ahead. Then Lumos. look closely at each gate for clues. This journal, like the dial requires focus. Art Noctua said the same. It may take practice to solve it. Uh, let me just play like this. Good up. for you. All right. So what should we do now? I think we have to check our notes. 
Is that, is that it? Outpost. No. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Inventory? Yeah, I think that's it. Not to her. Some of us literally buried this cryptorium deep within Hogwarts. I'm afraid I should lose my way around these dark corridors. I'm a descendant and yet I feel unwelcome. Fighting with these braces in the corridor is helping. The countless hard challenge by challenge, I will make my way through Nocturne Gaunt. Uh, just uh, <coughs> uh, final, final thoughts. It's nothing to do with the quests. Oh. Oh, we see this. Another gate. Seems Slytherin like to play games. Oh, it's like... That's right in the family. Look in a mirror, Sebastian. Ah, no. Wrong one. Is the snake... No, it is. This one, and then it's the snake. Matching right. the symbols did open it. All right. All Was right. about to do that myself. What about this one? Got to it first. What about <laughs> this one. Nice yeah. work. So we're here. Lumos. All right. All right. All right. This one. Nice. We got another door. That sounded promising. Another dial solved. Impressive. Nice work. Now what? Now what? Now what? We've got more to solve ahead. Search each corridor. It may not be obvious which leads where. Oh, so we're in the labyrinth right now, yeah? And we we're probably gonna get lost at some point. Bring Ominous, your aunt wanted to change your family's traditions. She did, and she was my favorite person in the world for it. So, there is a door, I think, over here, yeah? Which says... Lumos. Okay. Not sure references painful and arduous challenges, but also rewards. Painful. That's the part I'm wary of. All I heard was rewards. Keep going. Right? Excellent work. <laughs> We're another step closer to the scriptorium. Lumos. Now the door was opened, let's get to it. I spotted something ahead. Looks troubling. Oh. The gate! I think we're locked in. Again. Then Salazar Slytherin is not yet finished with us. What should we do now? Ominous. A skeleton. And Noctua's last journal entry. She mentions being trapped here, blocked by an unforgivable curse. This is where she died. This is where we'll die. I shouldn't have listened to either of you. Ominous, I'm truly sorry about your aunt. But I know what to do. It's going to be difficult. What was it? You said you know what to do. Tortured faces on the door, and Crucio is etched into the stone. My guess is if we cast the Cruciatus curse, the door will open. That's why Noctua died. She had no one to cast the curse on. Ominous has the most experience with this. He should cast it. You seem to be in Ominous's favor. Will you ask him about this? Yeah. He does seem a bit cross with you. Good. Work your magic, so to speak. Wish we had some liquid luck. All of this could have been avoided. 
Ominous. I hadn't imagined we'd end up trapped like this. Salazar Slytherin did. He's to blame for many unimaginable things. What are you doing? I overheard you and Sebastian, and I won't do it. The Cruciatus Curse is pure torture, I would know. Sebastian told me a little of what happened when you were young. Sounds as if you had no choice. Should have known he would have told you. And one always has a choice. I'm as guilty as the worst of my family. Unforgivable curses won't work unless you really mean them. I had to want to cause pain, and for that I shall never forgive myself. That spells the reason I have no family left. You and Sebastian will need to sort out another solution. Okay. If you cast Crucio, you will regret it forever. What do we do now? Ominous is not going to cast the Cruciatus Curse again. Ridiculous! As if dying in here is a better option than casting a damned spell. <sighs> it's up to us. I can teach you Crucio, or I can cast it on you. Wait, you didn't say you knew how to cast Crucio. Because I'm not sure I do. Ominous knows that, yet he's left us no choice. I don't yearn to follow in Noctua Gaunt's footsteps. I think I can cast it if I have to. What should we do? I want to learn the curse, but I won't cast it on you. You need to cast it on me. I shan't forget this. All right. So I'm about to get cursed. I don't know how, for how long. Ready? I'm ready. So this door took my curse away. Uh, are you all right? I don't know. That pain, it was excruciating, but I'll survive. Let's keep moving. We made it. We found Salazar Slytherin's scriptorium. I can't believe we're here. Sebastian, ominous. There's a book just here. You found something. You two go ahead. Let me know what's in it. I'll wander around a bit. May I have a look? What do you think? Looks like a spell book of some kind. This is incredible. A Hogwarts founder's possession. What an honor. Still can't believe Ominous never told me about his aunt and what she found. What will you do with Slytherin's spell book? What I do with every book. Read it. Having professors as parents ingrained that habit early on. But I can do that later. For now, I say we explore this room. It's breathtaking. So what what else is left to explore in this room? Linger here. Let's find a way out, please. I don't want to leave, but I owe you. Both of you. Without both of you, we'd never have made it this far. We were lucky. We could have died. We must swear never to do this again. Where the ah there you are, ominous. Elite scriptorium. See a way out. Best news I've heard all day. Ominous. About your aunt. Please, Sebastian. And now we know Crucio. Amazing. I meant what I said before. We swear, right now, never to engage in anything to do with dark magic again. Understood. 
I'm truly sorry about your aunt, Ominous. I suppose after all this, I am grateful to know what happened to her. Thank you. We learned crucial. Wow. I mean, guys, look at this game. This game is so beautiful. What a view. What a place to be in. All right, guys. That was it for today. Thank you very much for watching my video. Uh, and if you do like the videos you watch, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel as well. I will upload videos uh, every two days, every one day. Well, whenever I can, guys, whenever I can. Because my schedule is a little bit hard. I'm working as well. Uh, and I have to figure out the hours which I'm spending to create videos and my free time. Well, most of my free time goes to the videos I'm making, so I would really, really uh, appreciate your support. And right. as like always, see you next time, guys. Bye. Get away!